Fem Vivek. Good morning. It is almost 11 a.m. in the morning. The sun is bright today. Oh, very bright, very sunny. Good, good. Um, I'm going to eat the Greek yogurt with chopped peaches, bread, turkey, and this only. Simple breakfast. I was gonna get eggs. Eggs would be really nice. That'd be a really good meal. But um just decide to eat like this. Although well, eggs does sound good. But it's too late because the I already let this out. And there's fruit fly downstairs. Oh my gosh. I was just thinking of doing the same method that Judy did from It's Judy's Life, but I was like, I'll, I'll do it later. <laughs> I didn't have tapes downstairs, so yeah. Um I'm gonna wear this for a while, so you might see this um this top for a while because it feels like a bathrobe like I could just unbutton it button it and it's just so comfortable since I'm not going out I was gonna go out today but I think I was too tired yeah <laughs> I just finished watching I'm pretty rough stars season two uh freestyle rap battle and I, the first one was uh Hyoden versus Casper uh, I don't know about Jordan rapping. It just sounds like she's kind of singing her song. She was okay. She was okay. But I, if I were to choose, I would choose Casper. Casper was just like she knew what she was doing. She's like a like a real true rap star. So I like that. Um, Kill me versus Ashby. Well, um, didn't really like the performance. They just sound the they sound the same. So I just felt like. I don't know who was better. I mean, Kill Me was pretty good, but it wasn't like, like very good compared to what I think of Casper. Casper was better so far. And uh, Kitty B versus Heizy. Heizy? I don't know how you say her name. H-E-I-Z-E. -E, Kitty B versus Heizy. Um, I thought Kitty B was going to be like, she's going to make me sick go wow. But she was... I like people say she reminded me of Cheetah as well from the previous season as well. Um, Heisey, I'm not sure about her rapping yet, but she, I like her vocals. She sings pretty good. Uh, I think she sings better than Hyoden, in my opinion. I don't know. It's just my style. But um, Heisey, her rapping, she needs some work, but she she seems okay. Uh, Trudy versus Ansu Min. Yeah, um, they were very awkward. <laughs> Especially on she seemed she seemed like she 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 was oh she reminds me of that one rap artist the one that sang the song random Lady Sovereign yeah her hairstyle too kind of reminds me, she kind of reminds me of her um, but um, yeah yeah rap rap style kind of reminds me of Lady Sovereign that Lady Sovereign is more like eh. <laughs> yeah um Min was very shocking because before she like. Uh, rapped. She seemed very like awkward and she's like like some idol pop star. But when she, when she started rapping, she was just oh my god, like whoa. But still, I like Casper more. <laughs> um, let's see, Yezzy versus one the girls you've been and Sua. Sua was very um. I guess I look forward towards her more because she was a YG trainee, but then. She can, she can fix a little more. I think she was just nervous because she was, uh, you know, she's a trainee, and the other ones are all idol pop star. Like Yezzy's from Five Star, Five Star, Five Star, and Yubin from Wonder Girls. So she must felt uh, intimidated, intimidated. Yeah, <laughs> um, but she was okay. I thought she was better than Yezzy and Yubin, although Yezzy was good too. But. So I, if I had to choose from three of those, I would choose Yezzy because Sua sounded like yeah, yeah, yeah. Whenever she raps, she goes yeah. It's like, oh my god, no, no, no. That doesn't sound like a natural rap. She just sounds like ah, like pip, like a pig squealing. I don't like that. And Yubin, honestly, she sounded like she was constipated. She was like, ah, ah. I'm sorry. Just I just don't I just didn't like her rap style. I I think she should be the first one to go home in my opinion. But that's just me. What are your what are your guys' thoughts about Pretty Rap Star the rap style 
or a battle? Which who do you like the most? I like Casper. I Casper is just she looks very um when she started out rapping she seemed very chilled and like very serious and um I don't know it's just her how she came out she's not too serious she's serious chilled like she's ready to rap but the rest of them look like either very happy and giddy or the other one look like um way too serious like I'm gonna beat your ass kind of look okay mm, yeah that's just good and all but there needs to be some balance that's in my opinion so I like Casper so far I'm looking forward to her more than anyone there mm -hmm. a little bit late lunch it's 30 3 32 p.m. supposed to be finished like two something but this took me a while to make I'm so hungry I haven't been eating for four hours though yeah, um, we made an appointment for Luna. I'm very nervous only because um, at first we tried to do it at this all small animal hospital, but we saw the review on Yale was one out of five. It's eighty dollars just to spay her, <laughs> but the the Ben Bainfield was two seventy dollars, while the cat doctor is two fifty, and I prefer to go to a cat doctor because it has. It's better review, 16 reviews with 5 out of 5 on Yelp. That's pretty, that's pretty good. And Bainfield is 3 out of 5. Um, but the Fred Away one, the one that Toto went, is uh, $280, $290. And um, it has 5 out of 5 stars too, but that's like 2 or 3 reviews. I, I don't really trust the hospital because uh, Toto is acting all strange. I thought he was choking. But there was no nothing, nothing came out. But this is his third time and I'm really worried. So I don't want anything happen to Luna. Overpriced. And if something goes wrong after this, I'm gonna be so pissed. And I'm gonna be mad at my boyfriend for not just going for the cat doctor. Just try it. This cat doctor seemed more better for just in my opinion. I mean, the whole thing is called cat doctor. <laughs> they must be extra friendly to a cat, right? Who knows? Anyways, I'm gonna eat. Um, I'm probably gonna watch something on TV. Probably something something from HBO. Hmm? Corn, egg scramble with cucumber and turkey, and spam for protein. I am watching Dawn of the Apes, and it's good so far. I totally did not expect this. Better than Planet of the Apes. It's like the the apes wants their own home in space. So this is pretty cool. I like the apes better. Hi, Anni. Boyfriend's family is back. Um, this mom is cooking rice. I'm so sad about this movie so far. I hope it's a good ending. So far, it's not going so well. And Toto, he's acting strange. He just kicked uh, my boyfriend's mom's face outside, and he was so going crazy with his leg. I'm not sure if it's because of the vet we went to. I think they put something inside him that made him, or maybe the chemical react to him that differently. I don't know. I'm a little bit worried about him. I don't think I want to take Luna to that vet anymore. He's acting all strange and weird. It is 4:51 uh, p.m. I just finished watching the movie, and it was a good ending. So. Although I wish it was showed a little more, like something like I don't know. It was just it was a really awkward ending, but um, overall it was a good movie. I totally did not expect this. I remember a lot of my friends post on Facebook saying that it was a really good movie. And I was like, really? No way! I can't believe it. I mean, I didn't. I didn't mean like Planet of the Apes. So Mark Wahlberg, I didn't like it, but this movie was really good. It was good. I could totally suggest people to watch it. I don't know why my face feels hot. I should turn on the AC. Yeah. Bring, bring. That's crazy. Hi. Hi. <laughs> So funny you guys, we're supposed to take the glucose test like an hour ago but catfish was just so interesting and we were so into it that we totally forgot to take the test so oh my goodness gracious <laughs> it's just intense catfish it's like 9.39pm and we're supposed to do it at 8.50 something 
thought I was chewing like vegetables. Ew. That was stuck in my teeth. <laughs> my boyfriend was drinking his uh was it cognac? Yeah. He was drinking cognac and then he told me he took he took a bite of something and you realize it's a fur fly. He ate two fur flies. Yeah, we have, we have a fur fly invasion now. It was it was all about the uh, ants. Now it's fur flies. Oh my goodness gracious! Oh my god! Ants, spiders. What else? It's our our fault. There's a there was a banana, a rotten fungus banana on the chair. Yeah. Anyways, I'm eating sweet bun. Hoi ta, hoi hoi cha, hoi cha. Me and my boyfriend, we just watched like five catfish, catfish episodes so far. That's a lot, yeah. Um, there's the one that we watch where this girl is uh, pretending to be a guy, but then she was actually a dyke. <laughs> and it's really sad because this girl um, didn't know that she was a dyke. She stayed with a guy this whole time. She was really upset because she has kids and she even told her kids that she's seen someone. So it's really heartbreaking. Yeah, um... Yeah, so we're done with that. My heart feels heavy. Not a heart. Chest feels heavy. Maybe all that sodium t today. There's like too much sodium. Way too much. Um, right now it's 11.09 p.m. At 11.05 we took the glucose test after eating the hoita, hoita, sweet bread. Yeah. So it's 1.20. Yeah, gotta be careful. Look you guys, I took another Goku test and it looks like a heart. It's funny because uh, when he did it, the blood came out like a heart shaped as well. That is funny. My finger loves me. Funny. Um, it's midnight. I'll end my vlog like this. Showing a heart. <laughs> I love everyone who watches my vlog. Ha ha ha. I'm kidding. Uh, no, I'm not kidding. I love you guys. <laughs> Have a good night. This looks like a middle finger, but it's not. Good night.